Yo, yo, what's good? Let's get right into it. Today we're gonna be checking out the Glock 43X. So I'm kinda gonna, I'm gonna go over a multitude of things. I'm gonna go over the Glock 43X itself. And then I'm also gonna go over some of the upgrades that I have on it. And I'm a very simple man, so let's go ahead and jump into it. I must say so myself, I'm pleased. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into it. This is gonna be a broken down review of a multitude of things, but we'll talk about the Glock 43X itself. And then of course, some of the upgrades that I have in it, which is very minimal, but definitely capable, which is all my style. So in true Tyler Jamal shoots fashion, there's gonna be more shooting and less talking. But there's a lot I want to hit on, so that's why we're going to do this breakdown, how it goes. So, capable. That's what I think of when I look at this package here. The Glock 43X kind of speaks for itself. It's a solid shooter. It's a lot of gun. It's a lot of gun for such a small gun, especially for such a slim gun. But to me, when I put it in my hands and when I'm shooting it, I just feel on point with it. It feels a little bit more natural, honestly. And then with these upgrades, with the facts and firearms, threaded barrel, and compensator, I mean, let the video footage speak for itself. Uh, shooting it, the gun stayed on target easy. It's already a flat shooter to me, and that's just my personal opinion, but it's already a flat shooter without the compensator. But putting the compensator on, without a doubt, I noticed that the recoil mitigation was there and that it was a softer shooter 
and that it was easier staying on target. But hey, you put in the, the training and you put the rounds in, stuff like this really isn't too necessary, but it's nice to have. I mean, why not? So, I mean, you know, hey, I'm a big fan of this. I'm a big fan of the 43X. I'm a big fan of the TLR6, the laser light combo. It's pretty neat. And this is just my capable EDC package. 15 round shield arm magazines. It gets the job done. All right, so this is a good overview of my 43X and how it currently looks and what I do plan on doing to it which is very simple, nothing major. I do plan on getting the frame stippled, get a real nice stipple job. Now I'm gonna put that Hollow Sun 47K on there. Go ahead and shoot with a red dot. But as far as what I currently have on it with the uh, fax and threaded barrel and compensator, I'm a fan, I'm a fan. And in my opinion, it only enhances my everyday carry package. And it only enhances my ability shooting with this gun, which like I said, man, as far as concealed carry is concerned, it's kind of hard to beat this, how slim it is. The capacity you get with these shield arm 15 round magazines puts you right up there with any modern semi-automatic handgun right now, but in a much smaller package, which makes me a fan. So after the stipple and the red dot, man, that's just gonna be a great enhancement, which I'm definitely looking forward to. Should have that soon. Couple specs on this uh, compensator. I'll just go ahead and read that off. Constructed of black anodized 6061 aluminum, Faxon pistol compensators feature a uniquely angled front port single chamber design, enabling the compensator to improve consistency while reducing muzzle climb and recoil. The angled ports allow gas to deflect upwards as opposed to only deflecting sideways, reducing up and down muscle movement and improving reliability. Barrel protrusion is designed to fit flush with the slide and has been optimized for Faxon branded barrels. Each compensator comes complete with thread locker, two six 32 set screws and a 1 16th Allen wrench. So all that, <clears throat> all that basically means is that it's a beast. Let the footage do the rest of the talking. Solid gun, y'all check it out. Worthy upgrades as well. Facts and firearms, you knocked it out the park. Also, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I appreciate all the love and support that I've been getting both through Instagram and over here on YouTube. I'm thankful for everything that has been going on, and I look forward to all the work that's going to be put into the 2A community as a whole and being able to give back and being able to help. And so that's that's pretty much my purpose. This is my company, Liberating Methods, um, and I'm just here to do bigger and better things. If you haven't already, be sure to check my book out. It's available on Amazon and Kindle, and I also have personal copies, so that's available if you want to reach out to me. But a very solid book, a very eye-opening and perspective-changing type of book, and it's based on a true story from yours truly. So be sure to check that out. And uh, just continue to live on purpose, you know? Just continue to live on purpose. I'm a very thankful person. I'm thankful for Magpul. I got to work with Magpul and I get to see myself in situations like this inside magazines. Check out Caliber Mag. Awesome, awesome, awesome magazine. Uh, and you know, I'm just thankful. I'm thankful for where this journey has taken me. And that's why I want to encourage people to, once again, invest in ammo, invest in training, invest in that experience and in that journey because that's where it matters. That's where it counts. And so, uh, hey, you know, go get that training in, go live on purpose, go shoot guns, you know, just go make it count and continue to tune in and check out that good solid footage. That's what we're doing it for. Y'all stay solid.